Happening right now, staff members at Colorado Springs Library is now trained to give the life-saving Narcan medication to people who have overdosed on heroin. The program started this year and security guards at the Penrose Library downtown have already put their training into action. They saved a man's life earlier this month. News 5's Andy Cohen joins us now with this story you'll only see on News 5. Andy. Yeah, Robin Elizabeth, security guards at all of the Pikes Peak Library District branches are now trained to give Narcan and at four branches in particular, downtown, the Penrose Library, Old Colorado City, Sand Creek and Cheyenne Mountain. Even the librarians and circulation staff know how to treat someone if need be. It was Cinco de Mayo. A library patron told security guards Tessa Warren and Eric Scott that someone was snoring in a stall in the men's room. Warren, a former corrections officer, knew something was wrong. When we entered the bathroom um, through previous experience, um, I automatically knew that it was not someone snoring, that it was an overdose. Sure enough, the man left his drug paraphernalia on the toilet paper roll. It was a spoon, a lighter, and uh, a needle. His breathing was dangerously shallow, but the man had locked the stall door before shooting up, so Eric and Tess had to pry it open with a pocket knife. He was still unresponsive minutes after the first dose, so Eric gave him a second spray. Tess told me his eyes were blinking, and so that was a huge relief to see that there was some kind of response that he hadn't died on us. Narcan is the prescription name for naloxone, an emergency medication that, as this training video shows, is sprayed directly into a patient's nostrils to counteract an opioid overdose. Because I've seen so many overdoses and, you know, I mean, there's nothing that you can do at that point when you don't have Narcan. So for them to give us the tool to, like, bring somebody back from possible death is, I mean, it's amazing. The man was responsive by the time that paramedics took him away for treatment. And they told Tess and Eric that had it not been for their quick action, he would be dead. That was, it was very relieving to be like, hey, we got to save somebody today. And the library district received a grant from Aspen Point to purchase the Narcan. They've acquired 48 doses of the medication. Watching out for you, Colorado Springs, Andy Cohen, News 5. 